Hey there, art lovers. Welcome back to this art, the channel where we dive deep into the world of artists and their incredible artworks. Today, we're going to explore the beautiful paintings of Alfred Sisley, an impressionist landscape painter. Alfred Sisley was born in France but held British citizenship. He was known for his dedication to painting landscapes and plein air, which means he painted outdoors, capturing the essence of nature. Unlike some of his fellow Impressionists, Sisley rarely ventured into figure painting, as he found that Impressionism fulfilled his artistic needs. Let's start our journey through Sisley's artworks with Banks of the Lowing at Moret. In this painting, Sisley beautifully captures the peacefulness of the river, with its calm waters reflecting the surrounding trees and buildings. Next up, we have River Lowing. Sisley's brushstrokes create a sense of movement in the water, as if we can hear the gentle flow of the river. The play of light and shadow adds depth to the scene, making it come alive. Moving on to, the Seine at Grinnell, rainy weather. Sisley masterfully portrays the rainy atmosphere, with the raindrops creating ripples on the surface of the river. The muted colors and soft brushwork give the painting a dreamlike quality. Now, let's take a look at, St. Mams. Sisley captures the charm of this small town, with its quaint houses and boats floating on the river. The vibrant colors and attention to detail make this painting truly captivating. In, Station at Sevre, Sisley focuses on the industrial side of the landscape. The train tracks and buildings create a sense of movement and modernity, while the surrounding trees add a touch of nature to the scene. Moving along, we have, Canal at St. Mams. Sisley's use of light and shadow brings out the textures of the buildings and boats, creating a sense of depth and realism. Let's not forget, Banks of the Lowing. In this painting, Sisley captures the tranquility of the riverbank, with its lush greenery and reflections in the water. The brushwork is loose and expressive, giving the painting a sense of spontaneity. Now, let's explore, Railroad near Sevre. Sisley portrays the railway tracks with precision, while the surrounding landscape adds a touch of serenity to the scene. The play of light and shadow adds depth and dimension to the painting. Moving on to, the Seine at Churistens. Sisley captures the beauty of the river, with its shimmering waters and boats sailing by. The soft colors and delicate brushwork create a sense of tranquility and harmony. Next, we have, the road from Prunei to Bujival. Sisley's use of vibrant colors and loose brushwork brings the road to life, inviting us to take a stroll through the countryside. Let's not forget, the Lowing Canal. Sisley's attention to detail is evident in this painting, as he captures the reflections of the buildings and trees in the calm waters of the canal. Moving along, we have, banks of the Lowing near Moret. Sisley's brushstrokes create a sense of movement in the water, while the surrounding trees add a touch of serenity to the scene. Now, let's explore, Snow on the Road, Lovisiennes. Sisley captures the beauty of a snowy landscape, with the trees and road covered in a blanket of white. The cool colors and delicate brushwork evoke a sense of tranquility. Lastly, we have, Fields Around the Forest. Sisley's use of vibrant colors and loose brushwork brings the fields to life, capturing the beauty of nature in all its glory. And that concludes our journey through Alfred Sisley's artworks. We hope you enjoyed this exploration of his beautiful landscapes. Stay tuned for more artist spotlights on this art. Thanks for watching.